嘿，大家好，我是 Amber。嘿、hey, ，大家好，我是烧麦。上一期我们带大家了解了一下常用英文习语的基础表达篇，今天我们来看一看进阶版的表达。话不多说，我们开始吧。Number one, in a heartbeat. If you say that you'll do something in a heartbeat, it means you'll do it again as soon as possible. 就是即刻，立即的意思 Number two, over my dead body. This one is quite a fierce one, and it means if you say something will happen over your dead body, it means you'll do anything you can to prevent it from happening. For example, Joe says he's going to buy a motorbike. Over my dead body. 这个短语的意思就是来表达你对某件事情的强烈反对，除非我死了，绝不可能的意思。Number three, go the extra mile. This means you're willing to make an extra effort to do more than is needed. For example, she is a very nice person and always willing to go the extra mile to help others. 就是加倍努力的意思。Number four, I'm cool with that. 我同意。This means that you're happy with something happening or with a particular suggestion. For example, how do you feel about us ordering Chinese food for dinner? Yeah, I'm cool with that. Cool. <laughs> Number five, hit on someone. This doesn't mean that you're actually going to hit someone with a stick or something. <laughs> no, and it means that you are trying to flirt with them. You could say he was really hitting on me with steamy looks and innuendos. 看到他的意思是不是大吃一惊 ？Hit on someone 并不是打某人的意思，而是勾搭，就和撩妹一样。Number six, hit the sack. This is one that's probably more said by people in the USA rather than people in Britain. It means go to bed. So if you're really tired, for example, you can say, "Oh, it's 1 a.m. It's so late. I'm gonna hit the sack." 就是去睡觉就寝的意思。Number seven, friends with benefits. Friends with benefits just means friends who have sex. 并不是字面上的给你带来利益好处的朋友 Number eight, break a leg. This is an expression of good luck when someone is about to get up on stage and perform, or for something they're about to do in general. For example, Danny's family told him to break a leg just before he got up on stage, and this was to wish him good luck. Break a leg. 它的意思并不是叫你去打断腿。如果你为了某个表演投入时间与精力，要上台前呢，朋友和家人也会对你说 break a leg， 就是要你别紧张，祝你演出成功的意思。Number nine, on a break. Now you might have heard this one from the American TV show Friends. If someone says they are on a break, it means their relationship is on a break, so they're not together at that moment, but they're planning to get back together properly after some time. On a break 并不等于分手，情侣可能因为某些原因而分隔两地，或者情侣因吵架而关系紧张而暂时分开一阵子。Number ten, break the ice. If you break the ice, then you do something or say something that relieves the tension in an uncomfortable situation or when strangers are meeting for the first time. For example, he's so sociable that he's always the one who breaks the ice at parties. 就是破冰、打破僵局的意思。今天就和大家聊到这里，下期我们会为大家带来英语常见习语的高级版，大家一定不要错过哦。I hope you enjoy our videos and learn something new today. Please like and subscribe and look out for the next video. Bye bye. Bye bye.
Peace.